What is up? It's me, Mal925 here, and today I will teach you how to make custom sub badges for your Twitch channel. So, uh, I know whenever I'm streaming on Twitch, I get a lot of requests asking me about how to make custom, add custom emotes, how to add your own custom emotes, uh, I mean sub badges without paying on Fiverr. So, here's a tutorial that uh, I want to give you guys, um, you know, to help you guys out, grow your stream for free, you know? So, uh, you can make any type of badge you want using this software called Pixlr. So, I found this, uh, actually, this site through one of my uh, friend streamers uh, called Box Gamer. Go check him out. And it's quite it's quite a nice program. Uh, as you guys can see right here, I have my one-month sub -month. This is what I was testing with. So, let me just clear history right there. Let's go to Create New. And I suggest going into Web Small, right? um or full hd right um let's just go into full hd and let's make a one month sub badge right here right this can be anything you guys want right but let's keep it transparent this is like photoshop that's not really good you know what i'm trying to say so depends what you guys want to do as your sub badge right if you guys want to import an image you guys can do that right here go to image you can do browse and let's just say i put in this right add current right i can add a layer like that right and then I can put a badge on the background, you know, make it look sick. But that's not what we're here for today. I want to show you guys how you guys can make simple sub badges that look awesome and how to put add them to your Twitch channel. So if you guys have like a name, like, I don't know, like me, Mali925, or you have something that you guys want to use letters for, this site is great because you can just grab add text, right? And you guys can go here into text in the top left and you can make it any font you would like. So I'm just gonna put in, you guys can mess around. So I personally use uh, this one, Baram, for my sub badges. As you, as you guys can see, there's the signature M that I use, but you can make it literally anything. You can make a sub badge that says Mali, or let's say, I don't know, Hero, anything, you know? You can have an H as that. So for example purposes, let's just stay with my M, right? And this is why I really like this program because you can change the size, right? So I just suggest making it a decent size, you know, not too big, not too small, and just keeping it somewhere around the middle. So the file saves, right? Uh, you have line spacing. Don't really worry about that. Mainly just size and color. So with color, you can adjust it however you want, right? Like that, right? So you can make it whatever color you guys want. Um, as you guys can see right here, I use a little, I added a little crown just for jokes you know up there for my one year subscribers so you guys can make this any colors you guys want you can add a background um for example like i showed you right here go to background browse just put that in um create new oh shit okay i think i i think i fluffed it yeah i did damn it i got rid of the text but you guys can pretty much you guys have to add layers right and it's not that hard boys um okay let me get, go back Baron. there right you guys can use any font you guys like you got for example i can go to athens alvita is a nice one there's a lot of good ones over here you know you guys can just mess around with whatever you love that m could look good as a sub badge anything you guys want just you guys just have to mess around with the fonts you know uh where's Baron? there so and then you guys can always add another layer right like right here add another layer um, or by inserting and make add current right and then you guys flip the layers so you put the background behind and yeah so let's just say i leave it like this out white right to keep it simple then i would go to um where is it oh, right down here i would go to save right i would call it um preferably mali 925 right and I would save it as a JPEG or actually you can do it PNG. I think that's okay, but hold up. I don't know why JPEG's doing that. Okay, we'll just make it a PNG file because I think Twitch is okay with that if I, I believe so. Okay, here we go. So you guys can make image with image height, whatever you want. I just suggest keeping it the way it is. If you guys uh, want to make it 1920 by 1080 um, by, oh, it doesn't even let you. I guess that's the max. So if you guys just click download, just pull it up, 
right when it downloads so that's like my first month badge right i'm gonna open it you guys see that then i would go into this site called resize image or any uh, image resizer and you would go upload that okay boys sorry for that random cop there but i've been running into a whole lot of issues with uh uh my obs and this program but pretty much um now i think i got it all figured out so let me show you how to put your sub badges you made in uh photoshop or pixlr into um the photo resizer you guys can use any site you guys want right but i'm gonna just use resize image because it works well or it did work well for me so let's just put in uh my one month badge right here there we go then you guys want to crop it where you guys just drag and like release i guess you can say and just adjust it however you guys want you know not too big not too small and then you guys want to play press crop when you guys press crop then you guys want to scroll down keep it on no rotation unless you guys want to do something like that or like rotate it that's up to you guys and then right here we want to turn off keep aspect ratio and then you want to do 18 by 18 right so turn off keep aspect ratio and then uh make make sure the photo is transparent and P png works very well for this so yeah that's about it for the resizer and you guys want to do this for each one of these sizes 18 by 18 36 by 36 72 by 72 when you guys do that press resize image make sure everything's correct download image and then all you guys have to do is go here go to 36 by 36 resize image again download that it goes up here and then last one 72 by 72 download image oh shit sorry resize image download image let me just go um i know it's gonna be one in the middle so might as well do that you guys go to uh not here you guys go to revenue and then right here you guys would take uh is this the smallest one yeah you guys would take the smallest one drag and drop this one drag and drop and then the biggest one right here drag and drop so um that's how you and then you guys would press something called here called add badge so if you guys are interested in uh you know making your own badges make sure you guys go check out pixlr and the resizer um and you guys can do this for all your badges right i just keep it simple with the m because that's what mali is make sure you guys drop a follow by the way mali925 on twitch quick plug and you guys can make it base two month and you guys if you guys want to change whichever one you guys would just keep adding you know like one year and stuff like that then you guys can add flares but that's a video for another time that i can make you know so yeah boys i hope you i hope you guys found this helpful let me just mention that you guys can uh i was just messing around over here you guys can add a background and you guys can make in a, your sub out of your sub thing out of anything you guys can literally this is my uh overlay for my twitch stream big ups peter for making it i can cut and crop it right here and right here and i can make this a sub badge just the middle part or just the logo like that right i could just make the logo by cropping it right there's so much you can do on here or you guys can even save it as a whole file and then just add like a little whatever your emote is you guys can add an image like a bear or like a raccoon whatever your you know picture or whatever your logo is based on right that's what i suggest you stick with your sub badge or whatever is you know your signature on the stream so hopefully i help you guys in getting and making your own free custom sub badges because you know fiverr is not worth the money you know you guys can put a little bit of time and effort into your badges you know mine took really quick because mine was just an m i'm thinking of how to make them better constantly you guys should think the same way you know maybe adding a stroke anything you guys want to do you guys can also do this in adobe photoshop anything listen boys the possibilities are endless and it's based on where you guys want to end you know so it's all up to you guys on how far you want to go with your twitch stream how far you want to go with your sub badges you can make them really complex with cool backgrounds things like that where you guys can make them simple like mine right and just um let your subscribers have a badge you know instead of that boring base star you know so hopefully i helped you boys with um you know um making your own custom twitch sub badges so make sure you guys drop a follow in on my twitch drop a sub on my youtube i would appreciate that 
a like, you know, drop a comment if it helped, you know, any anything would be appreciated. Discord server link is in the description. The links to Pixlr and the online image resizer will be in the description. Link to my Twitch channel and link to my boy Box chan uh, Box Gamers channel because credits to him, man. So thank you for everyone for watching and I'll see you guys in the stream or in my next video. Peace.